Oh, man. Where am I? Oh, Jordan, it's you. Thank goodness, a friendly face, who also is wearing the same barrister hat as me. We were on the barrister ship when it crashed, you silly. You must have forgotten. <laughs> You're right, what was I thinking? Man, our ship is in terrible shape. If I punch this box hard enough, I may repair it. Yeah, that's right. If I punch this rock, I will eventually break it, probably. This is a game about punching rocks. No, this is not a uh, rock punch simulator. This is wizard with a gun. And you may notice that it is the first time that Cognitive Glitch, AKA Jordan, and I have gotten to hop into a game together. Jordan is one of my very good friends in real life. And now we are also friends uh, on YouTube. Yes, my name is Ron and I like to party. Uh, yeah, my, my name is uh, Rico and I like to party. No, I already said that. No, no one likes to party but me. But anyway, we are playing Wizard with a Gun. It is, uh, if you've watched our Don't Starve Together videos, the ones where Becca and I struggled through the, the, the beginning of that game, you'll know that, you'll see that this is a very similar sort of aesthetic, and we're going to try and survive as wizards with guns. Eventually. Right now we're just wizards with fists and, and some wood chips. Yeah, you're right. You're right. And we're going to talk to this thing. You aren't my first pick, but my first pick is already dead. <laughs> Ouch. It's not ideal. I wouldn't ask you to do this if I had another choice. There's not much time left before the world ends. You'll have to get into the tower to roll back time before chaos started wrecking things. There's a doorway not too far from here. Just follow the path. Okay. A cryptomancer. That's a cool name for a being. So why should we listen to the Cryptomancer? That's my question. Who the heck is this Cryptomancer anyway? Oh. Stand fast, Jordan. A foe is in the distance. Fast. All right, so can I craft? I can, I can craft a gun. Did that give you a gun? I don't think so. Oh, okay. But I did get a tiny leaf just now, so I mean. Yay, all right. Well, I'll, I'll save us. Get out of the way. Wait. Man, you think that trick's gonna work on me? All right. We did we did it, man. We survived our first encounter. Killed something. How did you already craft? I picked up enough uh I broke enough things to get wood to craft a gun. Right, I think I have enough wood, I just don't remember. Did it like prompt you to craft it or did you No, it didn't. I, I kinda uh I'm, I kind of skipped ahead a little bit of the tutorial, but it, it'll tell you in a minute. But if you press I, you can pull up your inventory, and then there's a crafting menu that you can you can open up. Girl, I want a controller. Oh. I'm playing your keyboard and mouse game. You're, not, you're playing in my PC world? No. <laughs> then press the inventory button. There we go. Yeah. I could have crafted like seven guns by now. <laughs> Why didn't you? Ooh, metal scraps. Got some metal scraps. Very nice. My favorite kind of scraps. Can I destroy this? Should I destroy this? These are things I don't know. Well, too late. I did it. <laughs> I hope I was supposed to break this. What? That's an ancient temple that's been standing there since the dawn of time? Oops. All right, cool. So I was able to use some uh, tangy leaves to make uh, an item that I can consume. It seems to be restoring my health. Oh gosh, I don't think I can break that. So it seems that there are also some objects that have higher numbers on them and obviously have higher health pools and so you can't break them yet Right. with our primitive wooden guns. So we'll have to remember to come back to some of these places and see if we can get to some new areas, unlock some new materials, or just in general feel more powerful. I mean, I just shot down a tree with a wooden gun. I don't know how I could feel more powerful than that. So. <laughs> I guess we can move along with the story. We don't have to sit here and gather wood the whole time. She's dead, wizard. There's no bounty left for you to collect now. Oh, no. All the doorways are closed again across the entire tower. She opened them all once. Perhaps you can, too. But she'll need Arcana. 
Chaos is just magical energy, malignant and mindless. You'll need to fight it to gather some arcana. To fight it, you'll need a... What did she call it? Ah, yes. A gun. <laughs> now that you have a gun, <laughs> you can gather arcana to unlock the doorway. It will take you to a safe place. Chaos monsters will drop arcana when they die. I call my children chaos goblins. Is that the same idea? Will they drop arcana? I think so. Yeah. If arcana are uh, moved from the table or <laughs> bodily fluids. Ooh, the last bard. The last bard. Everything comes to an end, kid. Oh, God. We've got the best seats for watching the show. That old ghost tell you the fate of the world's in your hands? I've heard her say that one before. It's a heavy burden to put on anyone. Don't stress too much, kid. If you fail, no one will be around to blame you. <laughs> that is so bleak. <laughs> that's that's maybe my favorite line of the game so far. Good luck with everything, kid. Good, good luck, kid. Yeah, thanks for the pep talk, Bart. Yeah, wow, so inspirational. Thanks a lot for the inspiration, last bard. We will be on our way. Yeah, shoot your bonfire. Man, we are savage. I'm going to go talk to the cryptomancer while you destroy the last bard's only source of heat. Sounds good. Be careful. Beings of pure chaos are coming through rifts up ahead. Defeat them to obtain Arcana and open the doorway. Okay, who's Arcana? Why do we need her? <laughs> Don't worry, Cryptomancer ma'am. We will find this Arcana and make her our friend with guns. All right, let's do this. I'm ready to fight. I'm ready to fight. I see a thing. Yeah, you Ooh. are running out of ammo. Craft another gun. Yep, 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 yep. They run out fast. Uh-oh. And I am scrolling past all my guns. I got it. I found Arcana. I also found a tangy leaf. Oh, 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 oh. Ow, ow, jerk. Pew, 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 pew. I think we got him. I think so. Gosh, I don't like that she just pops out of nowhere, though. I keep thinking she's an <laughs> enemy. Cryptomancer or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Cryptomancer, what do you want? Chaos is a relentless force, but you stood strong against it. Return to the doorway to open the tower. Don't tell me what to do. I'll go to the tower when I'm good and ready. When I was getting ready to play this game, I kept thinking of that. I think it's an Aerosmith song. Uh, something about Jane having a gun or whatever. Janie's got a gun? Yeah, I just kept singing, Wizard with a gun. <laughs> Shoot the Cryptomancer, wizard with a gun. Chaos is a real, oh, we already talked about this. Not, not having this conversation again, ma'am. I feel like now we just need to record a full version of that for like our, like the theme song for this series. Oh, sure, yeah. Oh, here we go. Let me use the doorway. All right. Oh, wait, we need more Ar Arcana. Oh, wait, do we have to share Arcana somehow? Yeah. Here we go. Ah. <laughs> Quest completed by me. Man. Oh, there, no, there you go. Yeah, that's right. I completed the quest. <laughs> All right, Tether Soul. I'm wary of doing this. I don't don't know about Oh, wait, I didn't decide to do that. I decided it for you, apparently. That is unnerving, but okay. Oh, what is this? Pick up. Oh, we found the first edition. Learn how to learn. <laughs> the first edition is an ancient Mechana tome capable of learning about the world around it. You can use it to scan objects to find out more about them. While holding the first edition, you will see an indicator above objects you can scan. You can upgrade the first edition, allowing it to scan more objects. Scanning some objects and creatures provides recipes for crafting. So, you can scan objects and learn things. Well, that is just delightful. I like to learn. I don't. I'm not a nerd. Reading is... Reading's boring. Wow, my first ally is the book itself. <laughs> <laughs> Can I scan you? No. No, that would be pretty awesome. Uh, oh, we need an arcane tome. Marissa? Ooh, an arcane tome. 
I have all the metal scraps, but I do need. We need an arcane tome as well. Yeah. Do you have those yet? I do have an arcane tome. Can I give? Can I give you stuff, or do I have to just drop it on the ground? Oh, ow! There is friendly fire. That's good to know. Noticed. <laughs> okay, there you go. There's your arcane tome. I'm gonna step away from you now. We did it. Research mechana. Mechana. Oh, this is where you make bullets. Yes, it is. Nice. Or we research them, at least. Oh, man. Fire research, shocking bullet, lightning research, physics research, disease research. Oh, my gosh. This is it's getting intense already. This is the origins of COVID-19? Yeah, seriously. This is how you craft the West Nile bullet. <laughs> Uh, arcane. Oh, the Annihilator. Yeah, yeah. So this is where you can put a... Uh, okay, sweet. You can put an empty gun in here. And I'm pretty sure it's empty. Like, the one I'm holding is empty. Because if I put it into my three slot... Yeah, it has zero bullets. So... I'm pretty sure... Ooh. Transfer that and that. And so... You can convert it into... Convert that into ten Arcana. Oh, what is this? Hey, I found a gear! What's happening? Oh, oh, oh. What you, what you doing? Finding out what buttons do what, apparently. <laughs> I just found one more tome. Nice. Oh, there's an Arcana bank. Yeah, that way we can bank it, and then if we die, we'll we're back out. I, I am just going to preemptively do that because... Yep. I don't know anything about this game yet. <laughs> I don't feel confident that I won't die several times. Can I reach that? Yes, I can. I found another arcane tome. The wheel delivered a gear. Okay, I I delivered an ancient gear. It appears that you have two of them. I do. Yeah, sorry. Yes. So let's let's turn back time. Time to turn back turn. The chronomancer's wheel. The god machine that rolls back time return ancient gears to add to the wheel and rebuild more of the world okay so we'll find more gears in the world every gear you add allows you to roll time back further and discover more of the shatter All right okay can we just pause and say that this the concept of this game is really cool <laughs> like, it's a, oh it's great what we just read that is awesome awesome world building yeah i'm liking this already Yes, and by the way, anybody watching this, this is a this is a new game. At the time of recording this video, this first episode, the game literally just came out today. Um, so we're we're brand new to this. We we Jordan probably knows more of what he's doing than I do because he's just better at games in general. But neither of us really know what we're doing yet. So we're learning this along with all of you who are who are watching. So. Uh, bear with us, because we might not be very good at this yet, but... Enjoy the shenanigans. My, uh, my excitement, as I'm sure Jordan's, is, is, like, at an all-time high for this game, because it is... The aesthetic of it's really neat, the music is fantastic, um, the... The combat seems fairly easy to understand, although we're <laughs> piddling around with wooden guns right now, so we'll see how crazy things get. Yeah. But in the meantime, I suppose we just need to roll back time. Did we already do that? Not yet. Oh, no, we haven't done that yet. So for the time being, it looks like the main objective we're going to have is to just roll back time um, and continue to rebuild the world. So we're going to do that for the first time right now. We did it. We rolled back time. I am so proud of you. Yay. I'm proud of me too. Maybe Hild is alive again. If you go through this doorway, you'll be starting a new expedition. If you die during an expedition, you will drop all the items out of your backpack and return to the soul tether. After 60 seconds, all tower doorways will close, locking anyone who remains in the tower until everyone returns from the expedition. Mm. Wow. Okay. I know. You ready? After that, 
After that little spiel, I'm not so sure. Oh no, all tower doors will lock down in 60 seconds. Wow. Okay. Oh, then. oh I'm sorry, I didn't realize that. I thought it was going to break you with me automatically. Guess not. Oh my gosh, what am I supposed to do? I only have 48 seconds left. Just go to the door, Bobby. <laughs> I guess I'll go through. <laughs> I got to the door with 50 seconds left, so... It was, uh, very, it was a very low stakes situation. Oh good, we have a map now. Pew, 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 pew. What do I get? Scrap metal, yes. Okay, I'm finding some mushrooms over here. I'm sure they'll come in handy for crafting. Yay. I love crafting things. Sorry, a fragrant toadstool. Ew. But I suppose that's helpful. Ooh, what are you? What are you? I found a cat thing. Get back here. Get back here. Oh, can I scan you? Can I scan you? Can't. Oh, I also think I found Hilda. But I'm 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 really more concerned with this uh, cat thing. I just found some like I, I guess you could call them ruins, just wreckage, um, and destroying some of the parts gave me more arcane tomes. So keep oh, an eye nice. out for those. They have like what look like books on the like attached to the outside of them, so you'll be able to see which ones will have the tomes. Should we talk to Hilda? Uh, sure. Or chase cat things. I'm good with either one. <laughs> I think we have to upgrade the tome first, because it's not letting me do anything with it. Yep, me either. Ooh, I found some more creatures. What are these? What are you guys? What are you? Oh, shoot! Oh, no! Oh, they are not friendly. Hostile, that's what they are. They are, yeah, they are not friendly. Okay, this will give me good practice uh, dodging. ha <laughs> ha! Man, I, I'm having a hard time fighting them in uh, close quarters, though. Oh, boy! Oh, man. Uh, I'm doing very poorly in this fight. Oh, oh, ooh, nice, okay. Scrap, ooh, oh, wow. Yeah, I got an arcane tome from that thing. Oh, shoot, I'm empty. I'm empty! Oh, there you are. Oh, 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 no, no, no. Oh, we almost got him. We almost got him. Yeah! Right. Yeah, baby. Got another arcane tome. Very good. Yeah, the nice thing about those things, they're, they lob, I'm sure you notice, they lob up those bombs, and if you're dodging them, then they're destroying the environment and getting you free materials. <laughs> it seems like the big priority for researching stuff, especially, is to pick up arcane tomes as well. Yes. Wherever we can get them. But I am also immediately curious about how big this environment is at the moment because it said as we roll back time we'll be able to reveal more of the shattered or the shatter yeah so um what i'm picking up is that right now we've only um turned back time like a little bit like basically right. just before the shatter or like just before basically the end of the world but the more wheels we find the more we can turn the time back and we can actually stop it from happening, maybe? Maybe. Or at least uh, have more of the environment available to us. Yeah. And as a, uh, a survival game junkie, that's the part that excites me. Ooh, I got an oak apple. Very good. Yeah, those are good. They, uh, they heal you up a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not as good as your potion or whatever that you can make, but... So that's actually the other thing I was just about to do is make some more of that uh, tangy leaf tea. Tangy? Yes. Before everybody roast me in the comments, I know it's tangy. I was just making a joke. I liked it. It's a good joke. We like to kid around on this show. Potion wheel. Oh, oh. There's a potion wheel. That's helpful. Oh, wheelie. <laughs> oh, man. You wouldn't believe the rim shot I just edited in after you said that. You? Oh, you're my replacement. Man, why Why are people throwing us so much shade? I don't like this. <laughs> it's pretty amusing to me. Honestly. People are like, oh, you? Why would they choose you? 
God, so I hope she knows what she's doing. Hmm. She's getting too old for this. Nonsense. This is a kid-friendly channel. I appreciate that. This is We Are a Family Friendly Channel. Ooh, head over to the loading bench. Ooh, here we go. Woo! Let's make some bullets. Wizards use loading benches to build spells on their guns. You will use it to craft bullets and powders with resources you gather from the world. Yes. Yes. Let's do it. So all I need to craft destruction bullets is wood. Really? Oh, okay, so each of my guns are equipped with... Oh, wait, are the destruction bullets just wooden bullets? I guess so. They, they really shouldn't be called that. Calling them destruction bullets makes them sound way cooler than they are. I don't like that. Okay, okay. I think I understand now. All right, well... You're taking too long. I'm making, I just built my own loading bench because you're taking too long. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm learning things. I know. I'm starting to learn how to use this UI. I have not played this game before, so... I didn't give me a hard time. Well, that, that makes sense. Because we, like we like to kid around on this channel. A world builder. What? There's a furniture gun. Jordan, why didn't you tell me you could create things like furniture and like uh, workbenches to make bullets? Okay, buildings constructed in the tower are permanent. Those in the shatter are lost when you roll back time. Oh, that's good to know, actually. Open building menu. Oh, that's cool. Okay, now this will be good. This is actually a lot like Valheim. That will be very helpful. Oh, that's great. We could build an annihilator out here. What? Love it. Love it. Love it. Ooh, we can make storage spaces in the tower. Jordan is going to be so great. We can make chests. The most riveting item. I have a confession to make. Go ahead. At some point, I killed that little cat thing. <gasps> and one of the things that it drops is it's, it's a small brain. And... The flavor text says, The mind of a small, innocent creature. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't even know how to look at you. I don't know if you are looking at me. It's all isometric. A simple destruction spell. A classic. Next time you're in the tower, check out the research makana. They'll help you learn to build better spells. You'll need to learn to build your own loading bench. The next time you roll back the wheel, I may not be here. Ah, I remember when I built my first furniture gun. Make sure to build a loading bench in your tower. It'll serve you till the end of time. 200 years ago, the world was broke and the shatter was created. Since then, things were stable. Mostly until we opened the tower and let chaos out. <laughs> chaos keeps destroying the world no matter how many times we roll back the wheel. Now chaos has broken the wheel. To rebuild the world, you're going to need to rebuild the wheel first. One ancient gear at a time. My allies, the Riders, <clears throat> sorry, the Riders, may have some of the pieces as well, but they won't trust you. This is the first time you've met us, not the first time we met you. What? When you roll back time again, I won't remember this. That was kind of like an Anchorman when he's like, 60% of the time, it works <laughs> every time. You're like, that doesn't make sense. Yeah, so after returning an ancient gear, you can roll back time to expand the shatter with new areas. Very cool. Okay, can we destroy the statue? Does that make me a terrible person? Let me see. Let me read about it. Oh, wait. Did I read about it yet? Yeah, yeah I did. The statue of Flora. Before the Shatter, she had a cult of... She had a cult following of Magi who believed she was a goddess of life, equal in station and power to the god wizards. The wizards of the Imperium found the cult of Flora guilty of heresy and attempted to stamp them out. They were unsuccessful. Chatterer, chatterer. Yeah, get good. Pew, 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 pew. Take that, statue. All right, I did it. We stamped out the heresy or whatever they tried to do. Yeah. Shall we return to the tower? Uh, yeah. We can return to the tower. 
Well, you can craft something with the heart of the innocent animal you killed. The brain, thank you very much. I feel it is also worth mentioning that early on in this playthrough, we will be narrating more of the instructions that pop up on the screen, since we are also learning this game. As we continue on through the game, there will be fewer instructions popping up on the screen. We can focus more on gameplay, but I do think it'll be fun to get to... Since the uh, game right now doesn't have any voiced dialogue, you get to listen to us read those lines. Put our own little dramatic spin on it, like the writers. <laughs> I played D&D. &D. I know how to put some stank on it. You did, hey, you put, yeah, put a lot of stank on it. That was the, that was the best way to say the writers. Thank you. Because you could have been like, oh, the writers, they're my friends. But you were like, no, the writers. The writers. They're my friends. If you have at least five arcane tomes and five metal scraps, you can upgrade your first edition. Ooh. I do have that stuff. But someone's using this. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Build your own. <laughs> Don't tell me what to do. You're not my real dad. Yeah, I guess it gave me that achievement when you did it, because I definitely have not upgraded my tome. So we can scan two creatures now with the upgraded tome. So next time you see a creature, Jordan, don't just kill it. Well, I couldn't scan it, so we'll just let it live. <laughs> just try to control yourself. <laughs> I am going to put down some storage chests. Ooh, thank you. Good I idea. don't... Honestly, man, I don't even know where to put them, really. Oh, you can deconstruct things if you ever want to move them. So that's good to know. Yeah, yeah I noticed that earlier. Good, 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 good. Well, I wanted to make sure that it was like... I mean, I feel like every survival game works that way, but I just wanted to be sure, you know? So it, uh, that would kind of suck if it was like, okay, this thing is here, and now it's here forever. <laughs> hey, if you you had five Arcana Tomes, you can research a new bullet if you want to. I'm pretty sure. Oh, oh, that's right. I forgot about that. You are so... You, you, you're so dang smart. Which bullet did, did, uh, did, did you research? I didn't, yeah, I didn't have enough to do the um, first edition and the new bullet. Burning bullet seems like the coolest thing. Oh, I don't know. A cold bullet sounds cool, too. Uh, it does. Um, it's a bullet that chills and slows down whatever it hits. A bullet that adds doses of poisons to whatever it hits sounds good, though. Oh, that's funny. There's a charming bullet. It charms enemies so that they follow and fight alongside you. <laughs> I like that. I'm not going to do it yet. I'm going to do the burning bullet. I'm just going to do it. So I had two arcane tomes, and because I was a very kind person and destroyed the last bard's last campfire, I got some charcoal, and with those, I get to do some fire research. So we can burn enemies, ignite pools and trails of oil, and generate mortars of oil and fire. I like that a lot. So do we need to roll back time for the next thing? Yep. Here we go. Let's do it. I'm ready. Reset and rebuild the world by rolling back time. Rolling back time, like good little wizards. Gonna roll back time and, t and stop bad things from happening. Rolling back time. Good little wizards. Oh. What are, what, wait, what? What's that? What's happening? Chaos is now breaking the world apart. <laughs> 